Gore-Tex is breathable. <laughs> Whoa. That's new. That's not. I should paint this, but it's way too cold in the shop this time of year. Unless... Hello. 45, boy. Sure is good to see you. See, I'm 42. I'm, uh, you understand. I got something for you. <clears throat> this watch I got here was first acquired by your predecessor, number 40. Manufactured by REC watches in Denmark. First company ever specialized in using materials from historic vehicles and the wrist watches. And this one's the Swiss made TTT Knievel. Named, of course, after Evil Knievel, the legendary stuntman who in 1977 attempted to jump a tank of man eating sharks on an XR750. Crashed in a practice run, broke both his arms, even injured a cameraman. 
we canceled the event. For years, that little Harley sat in storage till the watchmakers at REC struck a deal with the owner. Reforged the handlebars into 736 little stars like this one. Number 40 was a bit of a daredevil himself. He was also notably punctual, and Mr. Knievel was his hero. So if there was a timepiece made from parts of Evil Knievel's Harley, he had to have it. He knew it. None of us have any illusions of ever getting out of this job alive, but number 40 thought that if there was a chance, and if a man could make a 750 fly, well, maybe the jump's worth the crash. He worked some magic and got a hold of an early prototype, this watch. This watch was on his wrist. Every day he worked at Fort Nine and until he crashed riding Ryan's office chair on a half pipe and broke his neck. This time it was passed down to number 41. Number 41 was a bit of a hippie. He died of dysentery. He gave me to watch. I wore this hunk of metal on my wrist for two months until that table saw kicked. And number 43, he didn't follow instructions. Number 44 was a barbarian. He'd scribe lines on sheet metal with his calipers. Now, like us, these are serialized, highly limited, and born with a story. While each one may look alike, they are, in summary, completely unique. Now, if Ryan ever catches you with this, he'll confiscate it, take it away. But if the boss man really wants one of these, he can pre-order one at the end of October for a 15% discount. Knock the price down from $22.95 to $19.50. Free shipping, free 30-day return, no questions asked. There's even a three-year warranty on all products. Just check the link in the description. I mean, the way I see it, this is our birthright. I'll be damned if I let the boss's only occasionally greasy hands on our birthright. You know? But maybe one day, one of us will get out of here alive with this thing and learn to fly like Mr. Knievel. But for now, 45, I give this watch to you. <laughs> even worse now. Voice memo 23-188. This is Fortnite Mechanic number 45 to my future selves. The heat box is fully operational. We can now paint through the Canadian winter. There is one thing to note about the ventilation fan though. Do not use to exhaust hazardous or explosive materials and vapors. So you should probably replace that with one that's rated for use with combustibles. Also, uh, always keep your heater on low and make sure you get one of the ones with an automatic shutoff in case it overheats. Hey, 45, where'd you get that watch? Damn it.